Mike Huckabee was at a conservative event, and he made some comments that have caused a firestorm on the Internet. Democrats think that women are nothing more than helpless and hopeless creatures whose only goal in life is to have the government provide for them birth control medication. Women I know are smart, educated, intelligent, capable of doing anything that anyone else can do. Our party stands for the recognition of the equality of women and the capacity of women. That's not a war on them, it's a war for them. And if the Democrats want to insult the women of America by making them believe that they are helpless without Uncle Sugar coming in and providing for them a prescription each month for birth control because they cannot control their libido or their reproductive system without the help of the government, then so be it. Let us take that discussion all across America because women are far more than the Democrats have played them to be. And women across America need to stand up and say, enough of that nonsense. Yeah, Mike, uh, that's one theory. The other is... Democrats acknowledge the reality of the sex drive as a part of human nature and accept it as the fact that it is. And you, meanwhile, want to shove your head in the sand about it and act like it doesn't exist. Act like a sex drive is totally unnatural and you should try your best to curtail it and fight it and repress it and hold it in. And don't you dare give in to those impulses that you know you love and that you know you want to submit to. That's the other theory, and that's the theory that most rational people hold on to. Meanwhile, uh, what does he want? He wants less contraception, less birth control, less plan B, less condoms, less family planning, less of all of the things, sex ed, for example, that would actually limit the number of abortions, but then meanwhile, he's against abortion, too. So he's this massive walking contradiction. He understands nothing about women or men or human nature or how the body functions or how sex works. He doesn't get it. If you want to lower the number of abortions, you need to increase the number of the, the other things that you also hate. So you just, you're just clueless. And also I should mention over 50% of women that use the pill are using it for medical reasons. Conservatives don't acknowledge that and they don't understand that. And by the way, I have personal experience. There are some women in my life who use uh, the pill for that reason specifically. It's uh, one of the things it has to do with is cysts on your ovaries. If you're a woman and you have the medical condition of cysts on your ovaries, they give you birth control. Birth control takes care of that. Birth control uh, helps curtail that, helps limit that, helps eliminate that. But they act like, what? No, it's the only time any woman ever takes it is because she wants to be promiscuous. And by the way, even in the cases that a woman does take it because she wants to have sex, so what? It's none of your goddamn business. And furthermore, the Democrats don't want the government to pay for it. They never did. This is the incredible straw man that was created by Rush Limbaugh, was talked about ad nauseum, ad infinitum by Bill O'Reilly, everybody on Fox News, all the talk radio heads. Now Mike Huckabee's getting in on the business as well. Rick Santorum got in on it. They tried to pretend like Obamacare gives gives away birth control to all women. No, what the provision they're referring to is the mandate that says that an employer cannot get in between a woman and the health insurance company and the employer can't impose their own morality on the woman and say, since I don't personally approve of birth control, you can't have birth control either. All that that uh, provision in Obamacare did was say, we don't want a third party getting in between a woman and her health care provider and her insurance company. And it's so ironic because it's the Republicans who acted like Obamacare wants the government to get in between you and your doctor. Uh, wrong, but you want the business owner to get in between a woman and her doctor and a woman and her health insurance company. 